He says he had to do it to protect his family. Good evening, everyone. I'm Steve Hensley. Tonight we are hearing from an Owsley County man who says he shot and killed a man who pulled a gun on him at his home. Police say it happened this morning on Highway 846 near Boonville. They told Hillary Thornton three people showed up at the home to rob the homeowner and his family. This morning, police responding to this home along Kentucky 846 after the homeowner James Stewart calling 911 saying he had shot a man at his front door. When he pointed that gun out and made that statement, I just went four times. He never moved. Stewart says he had woken up to a knock at his door, then finding a woman at first asking for help. Stood there and said uh, he wanted a pill. I said then he needs to be going somewhere else to get it. Stewart says a man now identified as Charles Harris II jumped in the doorway threatening Stewart and his wife. The homeowner here says he always sleeps with his gun but hoped he'd never have to use it in a situation like this. I didn't want to do what I did this morning, but I didn't want him going in there and maybe raping my wife, robbing my wife, killing her, whatever. Stewart says he feels terrible for Harris's loved ones, but says he does not regret protecting himself and his wife. What do you think would have happened if you didn't have that gun? Probably got shot. I mean, he had rope, rope in his pocket. I mean, the police pulled it out of his pocket. He had gloves on, he had a ski mask on, you couldn't see. Investigators say Linda Peters was with Harris and was shot in the arm. She is now at UK Hospital. Meanwhile, Jamie Farthing is in jail, charged with robbery. I wish people would quit robbing these old folks around here. And I'm an old folk, okay, I'm 74. Hillary Thornton, WYMT Mountain News. State police say at this time, Stewart is not facing any charges.